We are now going to think about continuous professional development or the courses that you may be able to take as part of your time when you're studying or beyond the lifeline of your uh, current uh, educational processes. So where do we get the inspiration for these courses? Well, first of all, you can think about your uh, influencers, the people who are actually already doing these kind of things. Have a look at their professional development careers. What are the kind of courses they have uh, undertaken and what are the kind of qualifications do they uh, look for when you're looking at the actual ads or job ads that we were reviewing earlier. So these are some of the basic steps that you might want to think about. So if you try and make a list of courses that you might want to aspire to do, it doesn't mean that you will actually do them straight away. But it's useful for you to start thinking and planning ahead. So planning is all about being aware of where you want to travel and how you want to get there. 